Well, earlier this week, we told you the not-so-fashionable truth about germs and ladies' handbags, but we didn't want to leave it at that. We figured if women are carrying around bathroom germs, guys probably are too. SNN local news reporter Grant Boxliner puts our theory to the test, beginning with his photographer's wallet. I think they are dirty, very much so. Call them handbags or call them purses, but more than likely you can call them dirty. A study published in Medical News Today found one in five of these accessories has more bacteria than a toilet. Most people have um, normal bacteria that grow on their hands, their throat, that kind of things. But some of the germs found in handbags are the kind that can make people sick. Olivia Fulker is supervisor of microbiology at Sarasota Memorial Hospital. Certain situations it can be pathogenic depending on where you put your hands and then where you touch your face. I don't like set it down on the floor or anything. I put it on the little like hook in the bathroom so it doesn't get dirty on the bottom. This original study was about women's handbags, but we decided to see if men's wallets were equally as dirty. We're here in the SMH lab and we're going to put it to the test. Fulker swabbed samples of the wallet for testing. We're going to take these and set them up underneath our hood. And then we'll go ahead and put this in a uh, 35 degrees Celsius incubator. After more than 24 hours, though, lab managers say no significant levels of bacteria cultures are present. As for those handbags... Leather, you can clean the bottom with it, but if it's fabric, you can't really clean unless you throw them in the washer. Keeping them clean can be tricky. It uh, definitely needs it right now. It's from... You walk into stores, you walk into anywhere, you put them on your hands, your hands get dirty, you throw it on your shoulder, it's dirty. I'm not sure how many women are going to want to take their purse and soap and water it and do the whole bad. So it's probably, prevention is probably better. Reporting in Sarasota, Grant Boxleitner, SNN Local News. Well, in any case, health officials say the best way to avoid those germs on your purse or on your wallet is by washing your hands or using sanitizer. The company Initial Washroom Hygiene conducted the study 